Hello viewers, welcome back. Lucy and I here, just to remind everyone, we'll be live tonight on Tara's Apprentice channel, that's Johnny's channel, um, 7 p.m. Central Standard Time, 8 Eastern, y'all do the math for wherever you are in the world. Um, anyway, hope you guys can join us. We'll be doing our political readings. Um, Lucy may or may not make an appearance. Oh, she's having an affection attack. Um, I'd just like to remind everyone also to um, make sure you remember Psychic Violetta's husband. Um, it seems like he's having some rough days and good days. So uh, keep him and everyone else who is in our healing circle uh, sending beautiful healing white light, um, however you want to send healing. And hopefully he will be on the mend here shortly. Uh, I know it's good to see Psychic Violetta back on um, her channel occasionally. She's not on as much as she used to be, but it's good to see her when she does make it on. Um, so I guess before tonight's uh, Sunday nights live on Johnny's channel, every Sunday night, uh, party time, tarot, tarot talk, whatever we're going to call the show, right? I um, want to do maybe a quick reading uh, I want to see how Adam Schiff is faring right now. Lucy's helping. She's shuffling. I think Lucy needs her own channel. You guys just seem to adore her. She uh, gets more comments than I do whenever she's in a video. We love you too, don't we, Lucy? Yeah, she's. we've, we've been having really cold weather last week. It got down to five degrees uh, several nights. And Lucy kept pawing at the door, wanting to go outside, so I would carry her out on the back porch and let her see what five degrees feels like, and then she'd start reaching back for the door, like, no, no, it's time to go back in. <laughs> it's like, all right. And then she would leave me alone the rest of the day. It's like, no, I don't want out there. It's too cold. Adam Schiff, how are you feeling? Mm, he's feeling at a crossroads. Um, and has some decisions to make too. So let's see what that's about. He's feeling stabbed in the back right now. Um, his challenge is to bring cooperation. So he's feeling stabbed in the back by um, the Republicans and Trump, who's tweeting all the way through this. Excuse me. At the root of this, and I'm sorry I'm not angling the camera down because Lucy's here anyway. She's kind of half sitting on the cards. Uh, at the root of this, he is moving forward with the evidence and with the witnesses. Um, in the recent past, you know, there have been some things that weren't known that came out in the testimonies last night, or last night, last week. Um, crowning the reading, the Republicans. Um, Yeah, but wow, interesting, um, trying to read on Adam Schiff, and I've got someone's going to be packing his bags and moving, guess who that is, it's Trump, um, there's new money news still to come, and there's new actions still to come, there's other, um, pl new plans, new plans are going to come out, that's what I'm getting, something Trump planned is going to come out, something he planned overseas, with people overseas, um, his strategy. Yeah, and judgment's going to come down hard on that. So um, it's going to be surprising, and right now it's unknown. It's something that hasn't come out yet. So we still got some unknown testimonies coming in. Um, now that Lucy, Lucy's moved off my table, let's do a quick read on Nancy Pelosi, how she's feeling about how the hearings are going. Adam's so even-tempered, he's perfect in these hearings. I loved how he uh, called out when Trump was tweeting during Marie Ivanovich's testimonies. So he got that on the record that live time he's tweeting and, and intimidating a witness. Nancy feels like they're building a steady case. That they're, you know, pinnacles, it can be about money, but it can be about um, 
in the physical world, you know, pinnacles, coins come from the earth, metal comes from the earth. So it's about being grounded and steady. And she feels like he's, Adam's building a steady case. Here, I'll angle down for this one since Lucy's moved off. So, uh, Nancy feels like they have some decisions to make also. They've got to select uh, what are going to be in the articles of impeachment. And because more evidence keeps coming out, I feel like they keep um, trying to decide, like, how many articles of impeachment are there going to be? What are all the things like bribery, um, obstructing justice, all those things? So, they've got decisions to make. Um the challenge is the surprising news that keeps coming out. So whenever they have surprising news, they have someone else they have to bring in to testify. Um, at the root of this, things are getting quite emotional and crowning the reading for Trump. Um, the fool getting quite emotional, um, you know, and tweeting during the live hearings. Um, in the past is, you know, the quid pro quo, the sharing, um, the holding back of money from one, you know, holding back the money, um, give me this for that. Um, we're going to be hearing more about the quid pro quo. We're going to hear um, all the details of that. And the surprising news also causes them to have to work more to, because it gives them more to put into the impeachment articles. So Nancy thinks they're hanging on. Um, there are more secrets that are going to be coming out, so watch for that this week. Yeah, this is, this is bringing the end, you know, so there will be celebrations because this is bringing the end to Trump the Fool. Okay, we'll stop there. Thanks for watching. Um, please don't forget to watch us tonight, Sunday night, on Jan Johnny's channel. Our technology that we use to do the live stream together, because YouTube won't allow two of us to go live together, um, it, can, it only airs on one channel. We can't get it to do live on two channels at once, because one person is the host and one is a guest. So um, we're alternating. So this week is on Tarot's Apprentice. Next week, we'll be back on my channel. So stay tuned. Uh, it's getting really, really interesting. Bye.